Tetris is a family-friendly action selection tile drawing construction game where you're going to manage and organize a construction company specializing in utilities. And as you can imagine, a combination of strategy and luck is essential for the victory. Players will compete installing services while solving small puzzles that they will find along the way when excavating. Completing projects will give you experience points. At the end of 9 rounds, the player with the most experience points will be the winner. Let's take a look at the setup. First, place the two lab tiles in the middle of the table. Then shuffle all the unknown, rewards, repair, heritage and blank tiles and place 28 of them face down. This will create the city. The different tiles will have different effects and every game will be different depending on the setup. Place the different buildings you are going to connect the utilities to on the edge of the board and finally place the different sources for the four types of utilities gas, electricity, internet and water and that's your city. You can play with the different saves, you can create a smaller city, you can create a city that looks like a race, you can create a city that looks like a friend of you, it's up to you, be creative. Now place the turn marker and shuffle the project cards, event cards, company cards and place the market. Also create the stack with the loan cards. Give a tableau to every single player and also give them their necessary crews formed by one supervisor and two laborers. One die of the matching color to each player, the budget with $40, one NDD card and two projects connecting to the lab and the first player token. They are ready to go. During the first round, starting with the first player, each player will pick a source, then in reverse order, each player will pick a second source. Every round will be structured in the same way. First, an event will be revealed. These events can be good or bad, and they affect all the players. After this, every player will complete their turn in order. You will have six possible actions and you will have to choose two of them. You could choose to install some services, excavating the necessary tales and paying the cost for installing those services. You can move your supervisor on the board so you can start working on new projects. You could maybe get some new projects if the ones that you have in hand at the moment are not good for you or you could improve your company. This last one will be really helpful as it allows you to get more crews, install more meters of service and be more productive. Finally, after the last player has used all their crews, players will go to payday where they will have to pay for their crews. If you run out of money, you will have to take a loan. At the end of 9 rounds, each player will count their experience points from the different projects they have completed. The player with the most victory point wins. Utility is a competitive game where you will try to complete as many connections as you can before your competitors do it. It's highly interactive between players as you can build utilities from other players, install your pipes on their way so they are blocked, and pay them money to cross their services. This game has been tested in several board game conventions with great results and people wanting to play more. If you want to try it, Utilities is available on Tabletop Simulator. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video.